second year in a row he is leading the summer league team and they had a pretty good summer out here and we are underway with the nightcap on day two and quickly out of bounds it will be with Keontae George getting the rest of the summer off, but he will be part of some of these vet workouts that take part out here in Vegas. Collier takes the first shot of the game, and it's pure. And the Trojans saw that a lot. Who are coming off of an unexpected run to the NBA Finals. Seven foot five, Jamari and Sharp got the block, but he could not stop Kyle Filipowski on the second attempt. How about this matchup we got down low here between Filipowski at seven at 6'11", and, and Sharp at 7'5". There's basket interference. Because the only guys that are projected to be on the opening night roster as of today for the Jazz that are not here are John Collins, Colin Sexton, Lowry Marketing, and Jordan Clarkson. Other than that... To be honest with you, I think Utah Jazz are okay with a slower development for him. Yeah, Williams just one of 11 in Salt Lake City from three here. Turns down the three, takes it to the cup. A.J. Lawson, this is his fourth different run in Vegas Summer League. Strong move by Lawson. Sharp at 7-5, gets the put back that time. From Taylor Rooks in just a couple of moments. Filipowski, look at this old school basketball, the turnaround in the post. And Kyrie Irving, he said Kyrie talks to him about slowing down the game, making the right reads, reading things before they happen, and that both of those Maverick stars have expressed how much they believe in him and expect him to make a big jump in year two, and that begins right here, Jared. Here's a Jinsa. Nearly loses it, gets it over. There's oh. Brandon Williams Why not with put the it follow. in the other hand? 51st overall by the Knicks, then that pick traded to Dallas. They traded up Dallas pick from 58 to 51. They were so excited to get their hands on him. Cody Williams knocks down the mid-range jumper. Cody. Brandon Williams with nine on the shot clock. Mavs down seven. Mavs down four. Who are now just one of three from downtown. Brandon Williams. And Williams. He's been all over the place. Advantage of dynamic playmaker in Larry Markinen. And that's what everybody hopes to have on their roster. Again, I think Utah has a lot of decisions to make. He's under nine and a half points per game. Six on the shot clock for Prosper. They give it to Gortman, who on the clock, Gortman. The process of being repossessed. Ball by Cody Williams. And that's a good sign. Gortman to Miller. Really nice cut by Miller. Face down block. A.J. Lawson getting up and denying and getting rewarded on the other end. You love to see it. Jinka driving, kicking, the shot. Isaiah Whaley. And did some amazing things in his rookie campaign. Ooh. Second year player, took a step forward. It's great to see the growth in, in, in young bigs. Ajinka comes right back down the other end. Got the legend sitting to our left, Dave Freed, keeping stats, facts, information. He is the Bureau of Information. Filipowski. He is now up to 10. That, that was a travel. Well, he got away with it, I think, twice. The drive by Ajinka, and Ajinka has been all over the place. He's now up to nine points. This Utah team got some veteran, relatively speaking, play from Keontae Jordan, Walker Kessler, and, and not a City. bad play. I, I know he's going to get the hockey assist on this, but... Preston, nice bounce pass to Filipowski. Justice served. Oh, you're hilarious. Wellness check here in Vegas. We okay? Justice served. Pretty good. Pretty good, Jared. Corner, Miller, three. Nice handle there. Greens are 
high, and now A.J. Lawson. Knocking down the three. Baisley over to Kinsey. We've got ourselves a shootout here in Vegas. As you mentioned last night, got to stay hydrated out here in Vegas. Dallas with the drive. Right place, right time. Who else? Wiley, part of me. Lofton taking it to Wiley. The hesitation. Nice move by Lofton, who took a shot to the jaw after the bucket. Game reps. And a guy like Jason Preston, who's playing defense right now, is a constant workhorse. Yeah, when you're young and trying to crack the rotation, you can't because you never know when your moment will come, and you got to be ready for it. And all of these guys are in search of trying to be dominant in this league and stick around in this league, and you got to be ready. Lofton, the lefty push. Doing a great job staying vertical and utilizing that length. Prosper back the other way after Sharp's fourth block of the game. Right place, right time, Emmanuel Miller. Right place, right time, Emmanuel Miller. Does he get an assist for that, Prosper? Yeah. Might have been a, might have been a pass. The John Stockton statistician is here, then yes. Nine on the shot clock for Prosper, going at Lofton for Miller. Miller with the floater. Second attempt, Williams comes down with it. We've got a nine second differential, doesn't matter. Cody Williams. Dallas plays. When he did get in there, you have Luca, who has the ball in his hands a lot. Kyrie, they don't really push tempo. They did later on. They don't really, as Cody Williams knocks down another three, great. With the second unit, with Dallas, the way that they play, push tempo, he's done a great job of getting to the paint. Lofton picks the pocket of Williams. Collier racing ahead. Collier makes it a one point game. Open up 2024 Summer League action. We've got ourselves a one point game, and here comes that Utah defense. Isaiah Collier gives Utah its first lead since late. Often tonight, three of six, six points. He's looked to shoot. He'll do it again. Lofton fighting his way and powering his way to two. Well, you can't. <laughs> <laughs> so. Cody Williams is at a strong second oh. half. Rises to the occasion. Mavs trying to stop the bleeding. They've been outscored 12 zip to start the quarter. It's not going to happen here. Cody Williams comes down with it. Williams trying to follow the dunk. The layup goes. 14-0 Jazz run. And 6-6-2-15. Vegas, good place to compare a, a guy to a UFC fighter. Ooh. Whoa, baby, Darius Baisley. Don't do him like that. Oh. Williams answers. Dallas right back within four. Here comes Dallas. Four and a half to go. Prosper driving into traffic. No whistle, Sharp the hook. And Sharp's got his fourth point of the night. Lofton gives it up to Hendricks. Hendricks, the floater. Utah back up by two, under three and a half to play. Cody Williams driving for the Jacks. Now it's Isaiah Collier, his start tonight. Pull up over the seven foot five, Sharp and he Williams guarded by Collier, former number one pick, uh, number one. He has lived. He has the defensive end for the Dallas Mavericks. Collier kicks it, corner, Baisley, three, book it. Big three. All right, so Lofton now has to do some work here and make the free throws in his NBA career. He's a 62% free throw shooter. But I should point out in his G League career, he is a 71% free throw shooter, does Kenny Lofton want to miss here and create a rebound opportunity, which would then take more time off the clock. Yes, I, I think so. There's no timeouts. Dallas didn't have any timeouts. It messes up their rhythm it of their play. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter, yeah. He right, misses it, and here comes Prosper. He's got a hoist. He did it quickly, and Utah's going to win the game in the final moments.
Just run.